Santiago also happened to mention that she has been chatting with some of the other farmers. It would appear that news of Armando's tractor and Manuel's lost goat has spread, and is making them nervous. Of course, these two incidents are very different, but it's putting the farmers on edge. <sighs> Things like this didn't happen when my parents were in charge. I just need to make it clear that we are taking care of things still. One farmer has taken to planting old hunting traps. I don't know if they're hoping to catch a wolf or a vandal, but either way, I want you to remove these traps from my reserve. They are an old design, extremely dangerous, and have a tendency to injure but not cleanly kill the animal that wanders into them. If a person were to somehow be caught in one, I hate to even consider it. Santiago told me that the farmer who placed the traps has gone on vacation with his family. He's shaken. He had apparently spotted something running along the back of his fields at dusk, just as he was about to go home. I can understand his anxiety. Nobody is more concerned about the problems we're all facing than I am. But I wish they'd come to me. Santiago has been a real help, keeping me in the loop about what's going on amongst the farmers. But I fear that she is losing confidence as well. She takes my calls, but I rarely see her anymore. I am just glad that we see eye to eye about these dangerous traps. got all your fingers attached, yes? Good. Wait. Did you hear that? Alma and Arturo, a wonderful couple from a nearby village, have asked me to be present at their wedding. As you know, things are extremely hectic at the moment, but I'm considering taking the day off to attend. Arturo makes beautiful furniture and has refurbished some antique pieces for my family over the years. He's even let us use his workshop to make...